Yeah, I might believe you if you showed me a pair of monogram Batiste Galagaskins. <laughs> More likely, you just say I stole them. <laughs> Dimwits. Weren't you supposed to be somewhere? Yeah. agree to me by the huntsman's cottage old man always had a soft spot for me he could sense i was a family man a man of peace so a happy nature like himself would have never Kinda crossed confused. his mind to disown hey we're back in the old bar when we first went if i'm correct i think it is gotten cold Catch the running horse. Ah! Wait! Ah! I got it! Roach, get over here! Wait, I got it. It's okay. Thank God, slow down. <laughs> to think the lad would know me after all these years. They're smart. Grow attached. A bit like people. Saw officers weep for their fallen mounts. The wailing women and crying babes didn't move in one bit. Glad to see the horse is in good hands. The best. His owners. Do you miss me, Golden? Huh? Do you miss me? I'd say he did. Bolted off as soon as he sensed you. Toppled anyone in his way. Um, do you mark anyone calling after him? Plowing in armpits or some such? But one man here curses so odd, my neighbour, Mirko, gave him Golden to care for when I left. Want to go see him, must be worried. Here, token of my appreciation for running after Golden, to see you is all right. No problem. Oh, she was so late. <laughs> Come on. Talk to the hunter, all right, then. What the hell was that? <laughs> Guess it, it's more. Sorry, little boy, sorry. We didn't actually. Out in the hunt, Master Witcher. Thought you'd clear the area of beasts your last time through. Rabbit hunting this time around. Ah, so that's it. Maybe you come round, visit us this evening tide. Lurk is baking a pie. Mm, I don't know if. As you will. You're always welcome. <laughs> Oh. oh, this is the hunter. Yeah, this is the hunter we uh, first met. If I'm correct. Yep. She's gone. Mad she had to wait. No, eager to roam the fields. Prepared the cover scents and oiled the jaw traps all by herself. Make a good hunter, wouldn't she? Nah, too impatient that one. Probably snatching rabbits barehanded, putting them in the traps because they're too slow to step in themselves. Where'd she go? Not far. Over yonder. Farewell. Something ends, something begins. Who are we looking for? <gasps> oh, yours came back. I'm happy. I thought she died. <laughs> Not up to hunting rabbits anymore? <laughs> Not really. What now? Nothing. Just sitting, waiting for you. It's nice here. I thought she died for I swear, I thought she died. Now wait till you see Dolblathana in winter, and the Blue Mountains. We'll head east soon as the snow melts. I think we might have settled in a bit too much. You promised to show me that griffin's nest before we left. Let's go now. Are you actually interested? Absolutely. You said it yourself. A royal griffin's a rare sight. Not that rare. Venture to say we'll have to slay a couple more before we get back to Kaer Morin. But if you want to see the nest, it's just up the hill. Come. I guess. I 
why not see the griffin this? <laughs> we were supposed to train today. Uh huh. Tomorrow it's sun up then. Work you hard like I did in the good old days. Probably been a while since anyone showed you just how much you still have to learn. Mm. <laughs> Slow. <clears throat> Almost there. Yeah. Parkour. Ah. You're too slow, Siri. <laughs> Hoo -ah. Do it. Too slow. Get your ass over here. Hurry up. Deck talk. Damn, Siri, you need to train a little more. Careful now. This is no time for you to lecture me. Siri, wait. There's something in there. We really don't need to play hair and hounds. Siri. Damn it, Siri! Not hitting it, not hitting it, not hitting it at all. Why are you so powerful? What? Stop moving! You little shit! Stop moving! Stop! God damn! Siri! What? A hair faster. That's all it needed to be to rip your shoulder wide open. But it wasn't, and it didn't. We killed it. What is this about? You're angry. Wanted to unload. But be that careless, and next time. Don't you understand? There won't be a next time! Siri, what are you talking about? I'm sorry, it's just... It's not a good time. Wanna head back? Alright, enough. Let's go fishing. Fishing time, okay. Let's go. Siri, what are you what what's what, what's up? I'm scared to find out what she, what she's gonna tell me. I'm scared. We bring Dandelion a nice fat perch and he just might forget about the rabbit stew. <laughs> Shame he didn't come along. He could use a bit of exertion. Huh. Okay, I'm scared what she, I bet she's gonna tell us and I'm scared what's gonna be about. I'm scared. Ice shouldn't be too thick here. Uh-huh. Siri, what are you giving me the attitude? <laughs> How exactly do you plan to catch anything? <laughs> You'll see. Oh, time for Garrett to do his, his little spectacular witcher skills. Oh. Should we go? No, no way. Lake's gotta be full of perch, bream, or pollard. Mm, fresh pollard. Would you like that? I wouldn't mind some, but do we plan to wait here until he leaves? No, we'll scare him off. How? I'll improvise. Wait here. No, improvise. <laughs> Throw a bomb. I'm not going to hit the bear, but... Right there. Come on, show you something. <laughs> Good to see. Throw a bomb in the hole? Okay. Old witcher's trick for tough winters. Not terribly subtle, but... Effective. Mm -hmm. Right. Remember, don't ever do this. Why show it to me at all, then? <laughs> Just in case. Never know what could happen on the path, what could save your life. Go right. for a walk. Let's go. Who taught you that? Vesemir. A long time ago. How long? Very. Back when I wanted to call myself Geralt Roger Eric Duot Belagarcy. Damn. Damn. 
<laughs> Tell you about it tonight. And about the time you broke your leg after wagering you jump off the roof of Cam Morgan and land a horse's back. Huh. How do you even know about that? <laughs> Eskel told me. But I want to hear you tell it. I'm certain you have a rational explanation. <laughs> never gave me piggyback rides at Cairn Morhen, remember? Vesemir was the only one willing. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> have to wait till now to remind me. You've put on some weight since Cairn Morhen. So cute. <laughs> Siri. We should get back. Remember me training on the pendulum? How I feared I'd never manage. Yet you forbade me from giving up. <laughs> I was black and blue practically all the time. That pendulum was a nightmare. How could I forget? Those months at Cairn Morhen. They passed so quickly. I wish we'd spent more time together then. managed to forget it was today. They're here for me, Geralt. I'm going to Nilfgaard, to Emir. I know you didn't expect this, but in Vizima, my father and I spoke. For long. Argued, really, and parted. Then the messenger came with a letter. I didn't say anything at first because I wasn't sure, and then I realized I had to stop fleeing. I realized that if I wish to change anything, I cannot do so hunting monsters round forgotten villages. I must do so from there, from Nilfgaard. Is this what you want? Yes. You're not trying to stop me. Take me to the Blue Mountains by force. I've traveled half the world to find you, but I never intended to force anything on you. I know. You'll be fine. You're a witcher. We needn't say goodbye. Of course we don't. I don't know when we'll see each other again. Do you know where to find me? You can't possibly stay at Cairn Morhen all the time. Makes no difference. You'll find me. <laughs> True. Remember what I taught you. Never know. Could be useful there, too.
cara. <laughs> Tearing up a little. <laughs> oh, God. Ah. Ah, oh, man. It's okay. The Third Northern War ended. The invader from the south achieved complete victory. Robbed of Radovid's tactical genius, the northern realms could not withstand Emir's countless legions. Black banners appeared over Novograd and all Redania. Weary of rebel raids, Emir Varemris conceded, restoring Temeria as a realm in liege to the Empire. When the guerrillas laid down their arms, the emperor shifted his forces to other fronts. Through Nilfgaard's victory, the Marians got their country back, and history once again proved a consummate trickster. Having dealt with Radovid, Emir of Vardemris did the same with enemies domestic. The Emperor's loyal spies named all who had conspired against him, traitors, soldiers, and aristocrats alike. Though their mutiny had only been a murky plan, the Emperor showed no mercy, as was his wont. Whoa. While the continent bled engulfed by war, Skellige bloomed under Ceres's enlightened rule. <laughs> Unlike those who had come before her, the young queen did not raid foreign shores, looking instead to her people, tending to her land. The island-bound nation prospered, though its fangs of yore were dulled. All right. After years in exile, nice. Ciri returned to Nilfgaard, her paternal home, where Emir prepared to name her his successor. The woman had the necessary qualities. From her father, she'd inherited an empress's political instincts. From Geralt, she had gained a sense of simple human decency. Few monarchs boast both traits, which is quite a shame. Hard as it may be to believe, Geralt planted roots in faraway Kovir. He and Triss settled down, their home warm and smelling of freshly baked cakes. Guests were always welcome, no matter the day or the hour. The Witcher would take jobs at times more from habit than need, for Triss earned a true fortune as the mage advisor to Kovir's king. That's it. That's it. Oh my god. Oh, uh, overall, overall, I say we got a good ending. Overall, I say the ending. I say we did pretty good. Uh, the choices we made and everything and how it ended. It ended pretty well. It, it ended. It ended. I, I say I'm. I ended pretty great. I'm, in my opinion, it ended great. It ended really great. Oh my god, dude, this game. Oh my god, it ended. No. No! I didn't want it to end, but it ended. Oh my god, dude. This game, this series, this. It was great. Wow. Alright. Ah, when you start, when I first, when you like start a game and you're having so much fun with it, but you put so many hours into it and never thought you'd ever finish it. And I like long games. I really do. I love long games that's like really good games, like with good cutscenes and good combat and the gameplay and all of that. And this game, it, it had it had some flaws, of course it did. It would it, it isn't like a perfect, like perfect, perfect, perfect with all of that, but it's still good. It's still a great game. It's still great. I I I love it. Oh my god, this game. It's great. It's great. It's great. Uh, CD Projekt Red. Bravo. Bravo. Oh my god, dude. Uh, I'm so happy I got to play this for you guys. I'm so happy. And I'm so happy. And I thank you guys. The freaking camera cut me off. And, uh, 
and it sucked, and I had to close the I had to close the game up, and then whatever, start over again, and blah blah blah. Anyway, where I left off is was saying that I thank you guys for supporting me through this whole journey, through every episode uh, I made for The Witcher Three. I thank you guys for watching, and I'm so thankful for you guys because without you guys, without you guys' support, I would not be watch. I mean, I would not be playing this because. Uh, I did this uh, whole. This is kind of like a part-time habit of mine, I guess you could say, because I do got school. Uh, I'm doing okay in school. I'm not the best student or whatever. I um, another hobby is drawing. I'm drawing. I'm probably might be looking a career for uh, something of an artistic thing. I don't know what. Uh, <laughs> that's just a thought. And uh, the third is this is another habit of me me doing most of the time and. I thank you. I thank you all because I do this for fun and w without me, I just found The Witcher 3 2. Uh, just, you know, I just found it uh, in the Xbox 360. You were giving it for free. I'm like, you know, I heard The Witcher 3 is coming now. I'm like, why not? Fuck it. Road to uh, Witcher 3 and I did it. And it was just because of uh, I wanted to try this new game out. Then I fell, fell in love with this game and oh my god, it, it was a blast. And I just, I thank you because, you know, Without me doing this uh, YouTube thing, I don't think I would ever. I would never thought I'd be able to play this. Cause to be honest, I was ever. I was gonna skip this game, cause I didn't know anything about it. And now once I um, played it for you guys, I I I'm happy. <laughs> I'm I'm so happy, and I thank you guys for all the support, guys. Cause without you guys, I don't know. None of this would. I don't. We would never. I would never be able to play this game at all. Anyway, I just want to say thank you all for the support. I thank you everything. Uh, thank you for the support. And the DLCs, I'm not sure if I will gonna do it because I don't really normally do DLCs uh, at all. Like at all, I just do the complete game and basically that's it. But if I probably might do it, there's like like a fifth, like a sixteen, like a thirty or forty percent chance that I might do it. So the kind of chances are low, but I, I might. I don't know. I might do it because. Why wow, fuck it? Switch your dream, more content, whatever. Um, and yeah. So basically, that's it. Uh, thank you all. I, 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 I'm saying this again. I think we got a good ending. I don't think we didn't get a terrible ending, or like a, or I'm not sure. I just we just got a good ending. I, I'm saying that we got like a happy ending. I mean, Geralt and Triss is there, and Siri. Well, not happy. I guess. I guess one. I just get good ending. I said. I said we did good. A good ending. All the changes we made, we made, we did good. <laughs> we did good. Thank you all for support. I love you guys. And yeah, stay tuned for the next walkthrough that I might do. I don't know what, but we'll see. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.